AITA for not giving my son's mom makeup days after he fell out of a tree. My son Ashton is in the fourth grade and I share custody of him with my ex. We have a schedule where we basically get him one week each. There were times where she dicked me by taking extra days without giving me the same time back. For example, she took him to visit her family in another state and came back two days later because of flight issues. Because that wasn't her fault, she refused to comp me with extra days. Stuff like that. Ashton School is connected to a park, and every Friday they do PE there. Well he's nine and does stupid things, and decided to see how far he could climb a tree. He got pretty far and then fell out. He had to get emergency surgery on his leg and got a bad concussion. He stayed overnight and then had another surgery on Saturday and released that day. My ex and I didn't discuss the custody schedule. We were concerned with other matters. On Sunday, my ex said she was going to pick Ashton up for the start of her week and I reminded her that he can't be moved around like that. He's still loopy from the concussion and medicine and how are you going to get a kid with a broken leg into your two-seat Porsche? Another thing is that he's still not able to wash himself, and he will not let his mom do that. Just me. I told her she can visit, but needs to prepare for him to stay. She was angry, but knew I had a point and there were doctor orders. Long story short, my son stayed with me six days later, because my ex couldn't get the time off work whereas I WFH. Our 19 years old son agreed to help take care of Ashton when Ashton needs a guy for something. Ashton can now use crutches and recovered from his concussion and can go back to school on Monday. My ex said she wanted to be compensated for the six days she lost by having Ashton by getting two weeks instead of one. I said nope. She said that was unfair. I reminded her of all those times when I lost days for things that wasn't her fault and you refused to comp me. It's not my fault Ashton's dumbass fell out of a tree and you couldn't get a week off, so I'm not comping you. I told her I'm not going to be flexible with you when you aren't flexible with me. Edit, no, my son doesn't get to pick and choose which parent he wants to stay with. That's basically parentifying him. Edit, he couldn't wash himself because he was drugged up for a few days and it took a few days to clear his system. Also, he has a cast and can't get in or out of the tub. You have watch him because he will end up wetting his cast. Also he needs both hands to balance in the tub and obviously can't do that and wash his hair at the same time. If you liked this video, make sure you hit the like button and comment down below your thoughts. Also don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell for more videos like this.